It's your boy Homer Ziggy. I'm back in here with another video, and today we're gonna finish up some of the freshman freestyles from Double XL. And I'm doing two again because I missed because basically I missed the last one and the new one just dropped. So, and it's like this I want to say to this for those who say I do long react, long intros, and so it's like a four minute. It is what it is, because so sometimes I gotta let y'all know. So, it's like this. That's why y'all hating, so be quiet. <laughs> you still watching me, so either way, I win. But regardless, the first one I'm gonna react to is Lakia. Le and this was three days ago. And let's read the description. It says, Lakia is bossed up and bad in her freshman freestyle so let's see what this one is so we better check this first one out make sure you like comment and subscribe and without further ado let's get in the video they wait let me yeah they have the caption so hold on y'all already know once the caption is there i'm gonna be on it so here we go They told me stay hungry and stay consistent. I'm standing on niggas' necks. I ain't worried about competition. I did it. Killing these bitches. I'm here for the life sentence. Really the definition of coming from racks to riches. I'm a rich daughter. Shit talker. I'm the shit. They and the thing is, I never once heard about her. Nope. She's like one of those underground rappers where somehow they blew up. But she, hey, she, she got her fans, but it's like this. She underground with it the same way with Flo Millie because I know a lot of people have heard from her a lot. I know a lot of people heard about her and such, but not me. Straight up. Really the definition of coming from racks to riches. I'm a rich daughter. Shit talker. I'm the shit. They some imposters rapping about shit they never did. Bitches really don't know me and the shit it took to win. Call it my hood trophy. It hit different on my wrist. You can really tell the difference when you see me. I'm the living proof. Bitch, I dropped the top. You know the coupe it got a missing roof. Proved it to myself. I did it. Now I ain't got shit to prove. Whatever just to get to that cheddar like it ain't shit to lose. They like, Lakia, where you been? I'm where the money reside. This Gucci bag cost a band but got a hundred inside. I'm bossed up and I'm I'm bad these bitches running the high they say the kid heating up that's because the summer is mine on god mm. they say the kid is heating up because the sun is mine Ooh, okay she talking her she was talking her ish on this one and i'm bad these bitches running the high they say the kid heating up that's because the summer is mine on god So that one was Lakia. Now we're gonna go into Coral Ray because this one just dropped. So, and the thing is with Coral Ray, didn't like for the past what almost half this year now she's been everywhere. So it's kind of crazy. Then again, the baby did do the baby did blow up in 2019, literally at the first half of the year, and he was on Double XL. So. Let's see how she d and the baby killed his freestyle in 2019. So let's see how he d let's see how she does this. Wait, let's read the caption. It says, "Coil Ray numbs the pain and continues to win in her double XL freshman freestyle." Well, let's see how she numbs it. <laughs> Captions. Yep. I'm not popping out till I got a couple M's Damn. She sounds a w she sounds way more different when she's like singing and such. I'm not popping out till I got a couple M's sitting right in my bank account. And my family depending on me. I'm hey, and it's like this. That little incident where she and Benzino, she and her dad Benzino 
crazy to think that her dad is Benzino. The guy Eminem and ended his career. <laughs> who got who got his career ended by Eminem of all? Nah, not even all, all people. Eminem killed his career. So kind of crazy that she's trying to, you know, build her own career up while her father's career is down here <laughs> i'm the one that's gonna make it out i'm so paranoid i think everybody and the thing is and y'all saw that little blog where people were complaining about her cutting the line at an amusement park y'all grown adults leave her the hell alone i'm the one that's gonna make it out i'm so paranoid i think everybody gonna snake me out i think everybody out to get me now so that's why i'm geeked up off this henny now yeah, I'm numb in the pain, I don't feel it now And I got him so mad cause I'm winning now Get a Glock on my waist, I might air it out Fit it right in my purse, I don't wear it out And the thing is, with her People, y'all saw in those mean comments they had on Where the freshmen were reading the mean comments They talking up, there was one comment about her saying that The mmm That little part where she go mmm 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 mm, mm, mm. That and she had a good reply saying that, that mm -mm is streaming everywhere, has over a lot of view, has over what 10 plus or so million views on on YouTube and a lot more on Spotify or iTunes and so on. So, so trust me, that mm -mm is winning right now. So, y'all can't say nothing. Picked up off this henny now. Yeah, I'm numb in the pain, I don't feel it now And I got him so mad cause I'm winning now Get a Glock on my waist, I might air it out Fit it right in my purse, I don't wear it out Make sure the bag matching my shoes They mace in my gel and my chains, I'ma wear them out Yeah, this brand new Birkin can't fit in my closet Remember Brick gave me them hand-me-downs Yeah, parasitic uh, These niggas wanna eat off me What the hell, she just She literally just switched from that To now the female to now what people are calling her as the female version of Playboy Cardi. Listen to me down. Yeah, parasitic. Uh, these niggas wanna eat off me. I don't really trust niggas. Uh, shout out to Luis. Fell in love with this money. Yeah, I count it in my sleeve. Aviani this water. Yeah, he got it from the sea. I don't hear DDG's yet, so I can't wait for his to come out. But yeah, now to basically rate it off, so Lakia's hers were she was talking her ish, talking about how she bossed up now and such, and that she she's stepping on niggas' necks and such. Like God damn, even though she came out of nowhere and such. She talked her ish on it, and y'all, we already know how Coyle Ray is, so trust me. She got more to come in the near future. So if she keeps up how her career is going, ah, sorry. She can base, she's gonna rule 2021. So we'll see. But the next, the last one is gonna be DDG's, cause I'm not sure if I, hold on, let me see, cause I'm pretty sure. I almost reacted to all of them except DDG's because I don't see hers. I don't see his yet. Sorry. Let me see. Nope. No DDG yet. So can't wait to see when that one comes out because I know for sure people were interested in Moray's and DDG. And trust me, I already reacted to Moray's. If you haven't, go check it out. And trust me, Moray's was fire because he had a story on his and sounded humble on it. So I can't wait to see how DDG is going to do his, even if, if he does his, but regardless. But either way, man, those two, they were all right. They were cool. So let me know what you think down in the comments below. It's been your boy, Humble Ziggy, signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let go.